Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to chat to you guys all about a lash lift treatment. I recently had it done to my eyelashes. I absolutely loved how it turned out and yeah, I just wanted to share everything with you guys. So if you're not yet subscribed and you feel like subscribing, please feel free to do so. I would obviously love that very, very much. And also give this video a thumbs up at any point if you enjoy it. But let's just get straight into it. Okay, so I think I'll start off with the first thing. What is a lash lift? Okay, so basically a lash lift is when your eyelashes get permed in a way that makes them stay upright. So I think it was maybe the 80s or the 70s, people used to perm their hair like crazy. People obviously still perm their hair today, but specifically back in the day, they used to perm them into afros or curly hair and all that jazz. And it's essentially the same thing. You're perming your lashes in a way that they stay upright for a certain amount of time. I hope that makes sense, but if not, just have a Google um, with the word perming and pretty much it's all there. I hope that makes sense. Okay, then number two, where did I have my lash lift done? Once again, guys, Fallon hooked me up. I went to Fallon from Wink and Whisper. I will have all the details down below. If you're new to my channel, she did my microblading and I chatted a bit about her on both of those videos. So if you want to check her out and you want your lashes done, highly recommend her. Go to Fallon. Okay, number three, let's get into the whole procedure. So the first thing, guys, is when you go for a lash lift, try not to have any makeup on your eyes if you can help it. If you're coming straight from work or something, I'm sure that's okay, but it just makes it a little bit more time consuming and maybe a bit harder for the therapist to try and remove your makeup and everything before they start. So if you can, go to the treatment with no makeup on your eyes or whatsoever. And that's what I did. Then you lay down and the whole treatment starts. And the first thing Fallon did was she put on these like, um, they look like shadow shields. You know when you put those things on your face to stop fall, um, fallout? Is it called fallout? What is it? When eyeshadow falls on your face. She basically just puts these shields on and she basically puts that pad all over your bottom lashes. So your lashes are actually sitting underneath that pad and they're staying protected. Then the next thing she does is she puts like these silicone pads on. They're like little silicone pads. I don't know how else to explain it. And she lays them on your eyelid as close to your top lash line as possible. And basically that is what is going to essentially give you the lift or the curve of your eyelashes. You'll see what I mean as I go on, but she just puts those in place and makes sure that you're completely comfortable and you're able to keep your eyes closed without any discomfort or anything like that. Next thing is she combs through your eyelashes and makes sure that they're basically separated and then starts gluing them to that actual silicone pad that I was talking about. And it sounds a little bit scary, but obviously the glue doesn't pull your eyelashes out. It's just so that they stay stuck to that silicone pad and you get that beautiful kind of surface area to work on. Now that your eyelashes are actually stuck to the silicone pad, she starts perming them. So that solution there is obviously a perming solution. Now I'm not a scientist, I don't know the scientific term for this, but basically this perming lotion is making your lashes stay in that position permanently. I don't know what kind of chemicals they are or why it makes your hair stay like that, but it just does. So the way that Fallon has glued your lashes to that silicone pad is the way they're going to stay permed when the whole perming procedure is done, if that makes sense. Like I said, I'm not a scientist or anything like that, so I don't know the exact reason why your hairs are staying like this, but they just are. Okay? Okay? Okay, so once that perming solution is stayed on for a couple minutes, I think it's between 10 and 15 minutes. I mean, it's different for every person. But Fallon takes that off and she puts on a second solution. But now this one, as far as I know, and I do stand corrected, but it's basically like the setter, or it sets everything and makes sure that your eyelashes are rehydrated 
and moisturized and they're not completely dry or anything like that and yeah just make sure things stay stuck now once that solution has been on for the recommended time that obviously takes it off and this is where the lash lift is basically done so some lash artists or lash lift artists will stop here take off the silicone pads and send you on your way home but what Fallon does is then tints your eyelashes which is amazing because tinting your eyelashes just makes them look amazing and for those of you who don't know what a lash tint is it's basically where you dye your eyelashes a certain color Fallon obviously makes them a really deep black color and it basically just looks like you've got mascara on when you don't and it's amazing it really just enhances the whole treatment so I really like that Fallon actually adds the tint to the whole treatment as well. I just think it's something extra special and makes the whole treatment and your lashes just look amazing. Yeah, and that's basically it. So then all Fallon does is she wipes off obviously the tint. She makes sure there's no more glue left on your eyelashes or anything like that and removes the silicone pads, remove those other pads from under your eyes and you are good to go. Okay, so then back to the whole sequence of things. Number four, how long does a lash lift last for? Basically guys, it lasts between six to eight weeks. It's obviously different for every person, but you can expect around that time frame for them to last and eventually they'll just droop back down or go back to their normal state, in which case you can go back for a lash lift if you want. But six to eight weeks is generally how long you're gonna have your lashes lifted for. Guys, you know, I just had a brain fart. I just realized I don't actually have any mascara on. So you probably can't see them very much because I've got tons of other makeup on and no mascara, so it's not highlighting the lash lift. I do apologize. Let me quickly go put some on. I cannot believe I just recorded like 90% of this video with no damn mascara on. Anyway, I'm not sure if you can tell from back there, down there, but this is what my eyelashes look like with um, mascara on, and this is no curling or anything. This is the lash lift, guys. Okay, back to everything. Number five, is it painful at all? And no, this treatment is not painful whatsoever. It literally just feels like someone tickling your eyelashes. You can fall asleep, it's amazing. Your eyes are closed throughout the whole thing. And the chances of any solution or tint or anything actually getting your eyes is pretty much none. Fallon takes her time, she's very specific, very particular, doesn't rush it. And yeah, I'd pretty much say the chances of you getting anything in your eyes are zero to none. So, you're good, no pain. Number six, the aftercare. Okay, so I just had to grab my phone here, guys. Sorry, all the information is here. And basically, in order to look after your lash lift, just for the first 24 hours, you mustn't wet your lashes, don't rub them vigorously, don't apply any mascara, don't apply any oil or creamed-based products on your lashes, do not go in a sauna, do not have a facial treatment or a facial steam, don't swim, and don't go under a sunbed. I'm not entirely sure the whole sunbed thing, but if that's what it takes to look after them, just don't do that. So, okay. Number eight, finally, the before and afters. So here's what my lashes looked like before I had the treatment done. It's just pretty horrendous. Like my lashes naturally don't even stay parallel to the ground. They're like face downwards. It's, it's just, it's horrendous. <laughs> no, okay, it's not horrendous, but obviously they weren't that great. And that's what the lash lift looked like afterwards. Super, super damn happy. And as mentioned, for now, the next six to eight weeks, my lashes are going to look amazing. So it's really such an amazing treatment. And, and yeah, guys, that is basically it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed it and got to learn a little bit more about a lash lift and what it entails, the whole treatment, all that jazz. If I left anything out, I really do apologize. Just hit me up in the comment section and I'll try my best to reply. And as mentioned, they last between six to eight weeks. So it's honestly totally amazing. And Mike complimented me a million times on how my lashes look and that just makes me feel really good and I myself looking in the mirror, I just, I love it. I love this whole lash lift. So yeah, if you're not yet subscribed and you feel like subscribing, please feel free to do so. Once again, I'd obviously love it. And also give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. But thanks so much for watching guys and until next time, bye!